Yo, direct message to Polite. Yo, what up, bitch ass nigga? What's up, bitch little boy? Motherfucker. Finally, somebody with credibility, somebody with higher. You put me on your fucking platform, bitch. You put me. You decided to scam me. You manifested me, motherfucker. I manifested you and you, manif you manifested me. You built me. Bro, you're going down. It's war time. It's war. It's war. It's war. It's your family versus mine, polite. Straight up. Your family versus mine. You think you could disgrace me? Think you could take me down? Just, just, just dismiss me like that? Bro, that's the biggest mistake of your fucking life, of your career. And you, you, you need to be taken down. You know it. You had to manifest it. Welcome to Crypto Roots, bro. I understand. You're the one that told me. Yo, while you were scamming me, while you were scamming me, you were telling me to watch Black Mirror. You were telling me to watch that shit, bro. I watched that shit, bro. Thank you, because you got you gave me everything I need to fucking take you down. Spiritually, consciously, fucking financially, whatever, bro. It don't even fucking matter no more. It's fucking, it's war. It's war. I'll leave your daughters out of it because they had nothing to do. It's not my fault that her fucking dad is a fucking sociopathic fucking narcissist. Insecure fucking bitch little boy. Probably got fucking raped. Motherfucker, that's why you would hold, that's why you would hold such, that's why you would build so much fucking lies around you. Because you, you're fucking scared, bro. You, you could have kept it real with me. I'm not saying you should have fucking disrespected. I'm not saying you should have done any. That's that's your shit. But you could have kept it real with me. We could have. We really could have built some fucking shit together if you decided to keep it real with me. But you didn't. You thought you could dismiss me. Oh, bro. And the truth is, I love you, polite. Truth is, deep down, I'm so hurt because I love you. I really did see you. Not on some mentor shit. Not. not different levels of that but i saw you as somebody straight up that could have been a real ass dude bro that could have been a real ass dude straight up but nah man you decided to dismiss me from the beginning and that was your that was your flaw you built me you built me consciously bro you woke me up in the consciousness nigga nigga now i'm taking you fucking down you got to bro i got to i got to i got to bro it's just destiny, as far as I'm concerned. Because I can kill myself any fucking day, I told you. But I'm not going to let you fucking take my fucking father's life insurance, disrespect me, and dismiss me, acting like you live in some fucking rich Hollywood fucking celebrity. You scamming people, and you fucking scamming up many other people, and I'm stopping that shit, bro. I'm, I'm going to fucking war, polite. You're hurt, bro. But you disrespected me. And that was the end. That was the end. That was, that's, this is your end, bro. This is your end. It is what it is, bro. I'm not gonna feel, I'm gonna feel as, as non-empathetic as you felt while you were looking me in my eye and telling me that I would never go back to being homeless. While wow, you fucking scamming me out of everything, bro. Woo! Boy, if I would've known, if I would've known what you were up to, what you were doing, I don't even think I'd be talking. I would be making this video right now. Straight up. I can't even tell you how many people told me what they would have done. You know what I'm saying? But I got a beautiful woman. I got a, I got a wife now, bro. Look at Polite. Polite, I'm looking at you. I got a wife now, bro. Still trying to have a fucking kid, bro. Regardless, it's my family versus yours. We could have lived in peace, we could have been in harmony, we could have kept it real. Nah, bro. You woke me up to consciousness. I'm taking you out the fucking game, bro. Aloha.